Hey guys, I'm back to you with another video. So I just want to give you a quick thing I just made here, and I just did a lot of little test prints, but um, these little things are actually going to be used to align your bed. Align, not level your bed. I'm talking about just the uh, uh, spring steel uh, sheet. So that when you put it back, it's easier to align it. Um, since, of course, this one doesn't have those little uh, screws there where you can use to align it. So I made these little tabs. And um, these are not my idea, by the way. I, I know I saw them somewhere, but um, I couldn't find them again. So I'm not sure who the original creator of this was, but these are very simple but very useful. Um, basically, the idea for these is that you use some double-sided tape in this case, I recommend you use something like nano tape, which is great because it doesn't um, it, it doesn't like leave residue, and you can still remove it. And also, with the heat of the bed, these things are not going to come loose, which is great. Um, and um, basically, the idea is that you grab these and you put them like just around the corners there, like this you put one right here you put another one around here another one around here because of the cable and then the other one like around there and then that'll help you um, get this bit aligned perfectly every single time I've used this before I have these um, bigger ones but I, I they, they kind of stuck out a little bit more so when I was doing the auto bed leveling uh, the the nozzle would sometimes you know graze against them so these are a lot more flush um, and this is how you install them it's very easy but uh, you do require nanotype and some scissors that's really all you need you don't have to take off your, your um, entire bed or anything like that or do anything crazy so I'm going to show you how you install these real quick okay so I've made these specially uh, 10 millimeters wide to use this tape so I don't have to so I only have to trim it to size lengthwise but uh, you can use any size nano tape you want but I recommend you buy this one that's a, that's already uh, 10 millimeters basically all you do is you line it up and you get some scissors and and just cut it to size um, just like that so the thick side, that's where the tape goes, and then the thin side is where the it's going to go, like facing the, the build plate. Now I've sized these specially for this particular tape. Let me give you a quick measurement. So again, this tape is just about 10 millimeters, 9.75, and the thickness of this is about point seven millimeters around there um if you if um i'd recommend if you don't have this exact tape that you print one of these out first and then um using some tape on it just to get like a measurement on it just to make sure it sits flush with your build plate because as you can tell i made a couple of these and i, I kept for i kept forgetting to account for the thickness of the tape so I just had to keep redoing it redoing it until I, I just just had like a brain fart moment where I'm like oh crap I'm not accounting for the tape thickness so you know that's on me but but yeah plus if you, if you have to make any changes well these things are super easy to make you can make them in Tinkercad in like a minute these are what the dimensions are so it's about 20 millimeters uh, wide, 12 millimeters lengthwise, and then this one is oh, 8.3. I did make this um, just about 6.5 millimeters, um, just so it sits flush. Like I mentioned, this is for this particular tape, but you can always make your you can you can always adjust this to uh, fit your whatever uh, thickness tape you want. Just um, add or remove or make a little bit thinner in Tinkercad. It's super easy to do, so. Um, but yeah, 
uh, this is how you should, this is what you should end up with. So at this point, just remove, um, I'd recommend you first, uh, you remove your, your bed, just, just the sheet. And the way, you, the reason you want to remove it is because if, if it's not perfectly lined up with uh, the edge of the bed, then it might cause you just a little bit of a misalignment. So at this point, you just want to remove the, uh, so just remove the, the other side of the tape. And you kind of want it like almost to the corner for the, for the ones to the side, but the trick to this is that you want to, um, here, let me take this off real quick. You kind of want to get this flush first, like just get it flush like that, and then uh, push upwards like that, so that it's like as close as possible to the edge. And um, let's do the next one. I'm going to put this one, I'm going to do um, these ones. I'm going to take into account the extra space, which is like from, from whatever the, the cable is to around here, because there is a cable there in the way. So again, get it flush and then uh, push upwards. So that's that side. I'm going to put one more on this side and then one more on the, on the side. So again, I'm not touching the bottom of the bed yet. I'm kind of just aligning it. And then once it's aligned, then I push on it. Now, if you get nano tape, this tape doesn't come off with uh, the heat from the bed. I've printed these in PETG, so I recommend you do print in at least PETG or uh, something that's higher temperature since PLA might deform. Um, it might deform and it, it, I don't know. I don't know if you, you might cause your printer to explode or something. I don't know. You, you use whatever you want, but I recommend something that is a little heat resistance, at least PETG. And then we got this side. Okay. So just give them a press, just, just give them like, squeeze and um, from here you're all set um, just grab your bed and perfect so now you'll spend less time aligning your bed um, every single time so just like that oh, I think I put it a little bit to the left there there we go. Oh, hold on. There we go. Okay, so I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, it's very. I want to make it real quick because I know a lot of you and uh, just like me struggle to put this freaking bed on uh, properly every single time. So hopefully this helps you out, saves you a couple seconds, and uh, yeah, let me know if you have anything else you want to check out. Follow in the description down below. I'll leave the links to the files. So y'all have a great day. Peace.